Hello, Internet. It's time for day three of this Baldur's Gate Enhanced Edition streaming extravaganza of happiness. Let's uh, let's go into the Nashical Mines. Here we are in the Nashical Mines. Wow, that was fast. Um, I'm not sure why it says Dorn Thacko modification when I not do not have Dorn in my party. It's good to be back doing this. I think I may stream it tomorrow as well. So I'll see people then too. Hello, Miner Roofy. What do you want? Work to be done. Uh, what's making the miners disappear? Demons. The little devils. That Those are two different things, dude. Demons and devils are not equivalent. They talk of evil creatures in the lower levels. Oh, wow. Crazy. Is everyone using their ranged weapons? Everyone you Yeah. All right, cool. Not what's in here? Some interesting looking contaminated iron. It's coated in a toxic substance. All right. Uh, oh, shit. I just realized I'm carrying a bunch of things. Can I pawn these off onto people? No, that'll make her slow. Oh, he can carry things. Our monk is strong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll give stuff to the monk. He can carry his old wakazashi, too. Give the gems to the mage. Get the gems, Bentley Bear. That is both an old video game reference and a Game Grumps reference. With ease. Nothing in there. Nothing in there. Uh. Eh. I don't need shit. There's a guard, an Omnian soldier. Some of the younger guards may be nervous. I've been around a bit. Kobold tracks down here. Lots of them. All right, so that guy just confirmed that the little demons are, in fact, kobolds. Nothing in this direction. It's our first proper dungeon. Oh, I'm so tired. By the gods of all the depths, you scared the living bejesus out of me. Leave us to get back to work, will you? We gotta meet our quota or they send us down to the lower levels. Last crew lost five men down there. Did he just say bejesus? Which is obviously bejesus, which is Jesus, which would mean it is Christianity. What is the equivalent? Where would jeez come from in Faerun? Stand away, I'm asking the real questions. You should watch your step amidst the mine guards. They've just been itching for an enemy they can see. Tired of this accursed cat and mouse with whoever is below. Miner Cory. Oh shit, do these miners all have names? Uh, they did. <laughs> I think I'm coughing up blood. Oh, coughing up blood. Uh, I'm here to help. I don't know what you can do about it. Sure, there have been problems. The ore that we've been pulling out of this place has been crumbling almost as soon as it's cast. What about the miners? They keep disappearing one by one. Man, they're all coughing up blood. Minor dink. A visitor. Oh, glorious day. We don't get many down here, as you can imagine. Are you going to be going down to the mines? If so, could you return this dagger to Kylie? He dropped it when he went into the mine the other day, and I haven't seen him since. Sure, why not? Will it give me a pitiful amount of experience? I'll do it. There's another dagger. Some more contaminated iron. I don't need to pick that up. Oh my god, a kobold! Get him! Get him! Get... There we go. I wonder how many arrows we wasted. Probably not 18, so I guess that was worth it. I'm surprised there was one up here. I thought they were only in the lower levels. Plus, there's soldiers right here. Did you guys not hear the kobold that I just killed? Miner Bob! 
Hello, Bob. Leave us be. Do There's you know anything about the missing miners? All right. A dragon in the mines? Inconceivable. I agree. I don't think there's a dragon in the mines. Just throwing that out there. Is this really the fastest way to get there, guys? Could you not have gone up and around? I'm going to sneeze. <laughs> that was loud, I'm sure. I apologize. It will be done. I'm just going to send Sir Wombat up there. It's easier to send one person. Um, who are you? Minor Dillick? Dilak? Dilake? Dimidome? So dark. Uh, get themselves killed like the last couple. Last couple what? Adventurers, you idiot. So other adventurers yeah. have tried to come down here and failed. Good to know. Another kobold. Get him. Yeah. Strim, strim, stram. Hi, Gary. Hi, Neil. Nice to hear from you guys. Oh, this is the entrance to the next level. Well, I've been everywhere. All right, level two of the mines. That took me like five minutes. Yeah, that was a loud scream, man. Miner Belden. They're coming. The yipping demons. They're everywhere. Save me. Demons? Oh. Demons. like my audio is a little low i'm gonna turn it up with ease the game audio i mean more kobold get him more kobold oh hi sarah gosh all of my friends are here all three i don't have any more Save. Minor. Oh, these guys don't have names, so they're unimportant. So tired. There's nothing down this shaft. All right. I know at some point there's going to be traps in the mine. I just don't know when. Oh, there's still a soldier in here. All right, what do we got? A halberd, a spear, and a quarterstaff. No, thanks. Be done. All right, nothing down here. I see some dead bodies. These poor miners. Get them. Get them. Fire! Fire! Alright. Another one! Success. Easy peasy. Gosh, look at the animation on that water. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, another one. Dead. It will be done. iron carts to look for iron even though I already know what all of them are yeah okay. just checking to see if there's any gems best water best water NA 
save. Oh, there's that minor Kylie I'm supposed to give the dagger to. Hello. So dark down here. You have my dagger. I was getting nervous. What do you know about the happenings? Kobolds! They're overrunning the mines. Piece by piece. We used to see them occasionally, but now you can't go more than a few feet without kicking one of them on the lower levels. It's not so bad up here with the guards around. Still, I wouldn't get caught in the dark if I were you. Oh, wow. <laughs> Giving that random miner a dagger leveled my character up. Excellent. Level up. Oh, I can be even better with a, with a two-handed sword. Um... I receive an extra two to hit. That's big. And an extra one to damage. And an extra attack per round. I feel like I should do that. Sure, I could apply it to, like, a bow, right? So I would be more than just proficient. I would be specialized. But... Sword. Hell yeah. I stand ready. It will be done. And of course I got maximum hit points because I said it to give me that, because I As I've stated before, I don't mind save scumming, but it takes a long of time, so I figured I'd just save us time by setting the game to that option. Battle axe, long sword, short sword. I should, should save. 42 hit points is a lot of hit points. I should do a solo run of this game at some point. I don't know what sort of character would be a best solo. So tired. Another miner. I'm looking for a miner for that one lady. He has a specific ring on, I think. I'm, I'm looking for her husband. Is there ever going to be anything useful in any of these? Probably not. But if I didn't check, what kind of gamer would I be? Kobolds! You know what? Let's use our new two-handed sword skill. Oh, wow. I immediately took damage. Yeah! Get him. Right. Arrows. What's on this one? A gem. A necklace. And a scroll. What's this scroll? Protection from petrification? That doesn't seem very useful. Just distributing the arrows to the arrow people. It will be done. I may have taken four damage. I'm saving anyway. Another soldier? Can I take the stuff off this wall, soldier? I don't want it. So never mind. Oh, another dead miner. That means there's probably some kobolds about. If I was right. Get him. Uh, who are the kobolds attacking? My mage? No thanks. My turn to save the day. Hmm? Dead with ease. Dead. So many kobolds. Rasad, quick. Hit him with your sword. Oh. 
Instead, I killed him with a bow, point blank. Not a problem. Pick up all the stuff. Particularly arrows, so I never run out. Was there a little alcove here? There is. Probably with something I don't need. I was right. Another kobold. Get him. Alright. I'm not sure why I have my monk rushing forward, but... Yep. Yeah. Hey, you got... How much damage did you take? Four. I have no idea if this game actually implements, like, you're not as good at using your ranged weapon if you're right next to the enemy that you're shooting at. Ooh, this one has a vial of mysterious liquid. Oh, they all do. Uh, that's not true. Only two of them did. What is this? This potion contains a strange green substance similar to residue that you have seen in some of the mining carts. The liquid inside appears very slightly discolor iron that has come in contact with it, and it's related to the mysterious plague that renders smelted weapons and tools brittle. The kobolds you killed must have tainted all the ore, leaving the mine. It's unlikely they would have concocted this plan themselves, however. Drink it? No. With ease. Your wish? With ease. Alright, and down to level three, the actual dangerous level you of the must mine. Gather your party before venturing forth. And there's the wedding With ring. Ease. Joseph's Greenstone Ring. Yep. Give that to someone who can carry light things. Drank? Okay. What are you talking about? The poisonous potion? I'm not doing that. With ease. Alright, at this point, there's going to be a lot more kobolds to fight on this level. Ah. Oh my god, that cart had a healing potion. It's something actually useful. I like that, yes, kobolds are rather unthreatening. That's the word, right? Unthreatened? But there's so many of them that even with six characters, you could get overwhelmed. Hell, my mage could die in one hit still. And yet, I let her run up and try and throw stones. Looks like there could be kobolds in it. Speak of the devil. Dead. Dead. Quick, use your your uh your wakazashi plus one. Yeah. Excellent. Tilune guides my hand. Get wrecked, kobolds. I shall commit to Flee, the task. monk. I stand ready. I am prepared. Uh, uh -huh. let's I'll not have the mage in front, please. Alright. I shall commit to the task. Why am I having the monk pick things up? Well, he moves fast. It's kind of the main reason that you even use a monk. They can kite the enemy. The monk is honestly a very good explorer. I'll do my best. I could probably use a strategy where he aggro's enemies and then just runs back to the group. I to the task. Uh, this is... This is... A dead end. It will be done. so much for that strategy. And I'll never do it again.
Let's not go across that gap yet. There's still stuff to explore on this side. Ooh, maybe there's traps on that get bridge. I should definitely check. Kill the kobold. Uh, maybe not have him in the front. Get a monk. With ease. Yeah. I look How close is he leveling up? Extremely close. I shall commit to the task. I understand. Why would he pick up arrows? He doesn't know how to use a bow. Whatever. It will be done. Those kobolds are dead. Oh my god, there was still a kobold up here. I understand. Hmm? They coming? Yes. Kobolds. Not a problem. Huh. Oh! Rasad just fucking took a crit <laughs> and died. I don't want him to be dead. Um, not a problem. Well, what are you gonna do? Huh? Quick save. That's what you do. Stupid. That was a maximum crit too. A bow and arrow can only deal six damage maximum, and it dealt twelve. Because of course it did. You know what? With ease. Let's have the guy that has uh, more than three times Rasad's health walk up front. With ease, it will be done. In fact, screw it. <laughs> I'll just be a pincushion. I'm better at hitting stuff with my sword anyway. It will be done. Like that. Yeah, there we go. This is a much better idea. Yes, it wait for be Rasad done. to get to a higher level before he actually engages in melee combat. There's a lot of kobolds. Just crush them one by one, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Get him. Ooh. Did I get crit again? Uh. No, it was just seven damage. up all the arrows. No wonder Rashad fucking died in that fight. That was a lot of kobolds with bows all at once. I mean, sure, he got crit, but if I had gone into that fight and he didn't get crit, I feel like he still would have died. Okay, I feel like there could be traps. So I'm going to uh, this way. have Imowen check. Oh, well, there's a kobold. Oh. oh, there was a trap. Well, that's why I saved. Okay, how about... With ease. Okay, I've aggroed them. Not Look back problem. up. You gonna... With ease. You gonna... Kobolds? Um... Kobolds? Alright, look for traps then. There we go. Disarm the traps. I said disarm the traps. Okay, good. Disarm this one too. 
All right, cool. Was that all of them? I feel like that was probably all of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not a problem. Good job, Imowen. You didn't fail either of those. Quick save, quick save. Excellent. That's how things are supposed to go. I will be right back. There is music playing in my house that I can hear the bass of, and I don't know if the stream can hear it, but it's bugging the hell out of me, so I'm gonna go fix that. Well, I'm glad that the stream cannot hear it, Gary, but as I said, it was bugging the fuck out of me. With ease. In order to take out my frustrations, I will uh, kill some kobolds. I feel like there's dangerous spiders in this part of the mine, too. Could be wrong, though. No, don't walk that way, guys. That's a ghoul! Why is there a ghoul in here? I was right, there are dangerous spiders. Get them. Nature service for the group. What is the spider attacking? My turn to save the day. Oh, it's dead. And Rasad leveled up. Heck yeah. Alright. What happens when he levels up? Uh, his ability to hit is better. He gets some skill points to put into moving silently. He got some hit points. Is that literally it? Okay. I, f I was hoping he'd be a bit better than that. What level is he? He's level three? 
Oof. Okay. It will be done. Another huge spider. Get him. Who is it attacking? Emma win. No. I'm gone. And it's dead. And now Nira leveled up. All right. This one actually matters. She's going to get more spells. Oh, boy. She has eight whole hit points. And she got another first level spell. That's good for me. Especially because currently she only has Identify memorized. Let's give her... I don't know if I want to give her Nahel's Reckless Dwayamer. That's the... It forces a roll on the wild magic table, and that can be bad. Let's just go with a good old... Um... Right now, Chromatic Orb gives a minus one penalty to all of their physical stats. That's not bad. Sure. Chromatic Orb and I mean, good old Magic Missile, right? It's really not good until another level, though. What does Shield do? How long does it last? An hour? Versus the armor that lasts nine? What is her armor class right now? Yeah, that could be good for her to learn armor and cast it once a day. Sure. Well, those spiders no didn't have anything cool on them. I'm going to save. Found some more best water. Some more and more best water. Oh, there's kobolds. Okay. Huh, <laughs> dead. With ease. I'd like the uh, front of the party to be in the front, please. Our pincushion's wearing uh, armor. <gasps> Damn it, Rashad! What did I just say? Too fast for his own good, I swear. It will be done. No. I've done had enough of this. There's lava in these here crevices. With we ease. have, you know, guy with an armor class of negative one go forward, hmm? please. Not a problem. Ooh. Had some fire arrows. It will be That's done. exciting. Okay. Um, I'm going to save again. I feel like there's traps You're a here. Queer fellow. I'm gone. My memory says... Yep. Okay. My memory is right. Good job, everyone. Save. Good. Good. Excellent. Not a problem. Did you guys see how I remembered those traps? I'm incredible. Still gotta explore the rest of the zone, though. Mine area three. Dead kobold. Dead kobold. No! There was a trap. Oh! Well. With ease. Excellent. 
Excellent. Any more kobolds? All right, Emelyn. Now that we're in an alternate dimension where we didn't walk onto traps, you're going to disarm some traps. Excellent. Good. Safe. Not a problem. Guys, we're not in combat anymore. You can turn off the music. Somebody stop the choir. Please. Stop the band. John Williams! With ease. I mean, yeah, With it's ease. hype, but this is what anxiety feels like. You're walking around doing nothing, and this music is playing. Oh, is this another uh, potential trap fellow. zone? I'm gone. Emelyn, check it for me. Anything? Anything? Well, I guess potential trap zone, yeah. It will be done. Okay, I've, I've explored the entirety of the level. Now we can go on to the next part. Alright, this is when the music would normally end. Nope, just continues. I swear. Look at how much faster the monk is compared to everyone else. Ridiculous. Maybe I would play a solo game as a monk. Can the... Can the music stop you must gather your party when we go to the next zone? Music, please. Okay, what if I turn it off and on again? Oh, is it done? Finally. Alright, saving again. What is on my Okay. Hmm? With ease. Get him. Okay. This part of the mine is much more well lit. some naughty kobolds. You guys think there might uh, be a trap on that bridge? Could be. Um, what is this? A gray ooze. Kill it? Um, okay, yeah. Gray ooze can take damage from weapons, so... Ow! <laughs> okay. Well, that was a worthwhile experience. Is there another one? There is. Get it. Another quick save. No, another dope looking water again. You you know it. Oh, you must that makes us leave. I don't want to leave. I'm kind of in the mine for a purpose. Spoiler alert, if you leave that way, you can't come back. So you have to go all the way around back through the mines. And that's not... No, it's not what I want to do. Pick up some more fire arrows. Are there any more kobolds around here? Uh, there's a ghoul. Yeah, keep keep going. Get him. God damn it, Rashad! I shall commit to the task. Uh-huh. Okay. 
I kind of want to rest before we go into the next part of the dungeon. We've taken enough damage, and I'd like to have some spells. Let's quick save. I would like to have the mage write this magic. Good. Have some scrolls here. The scrolls are worth some money. Yeah, I'll put them in the scroll case. Potion of Defense sets an armor class to zero. Ooh, that would be good for the monk. His armor class is currently eight, and then with all of his modifiers, it goes down to three. Yeah, that could be pretty good. Another way you could play a solo monk game. That might be something that I do at some point. It's just see how that goes. Uh, oil of speed. Necklaces. Oh man, I have so many arrows. And here's the arrows I wanted to identify. I really only have four? I could have sworn I picked up more than that. Well, okay, I guess I have four. Look at that, their arrow of fire plus two. It's honestly really good. Um, let's change. I don't want to know all of these identify spells. I, one identify is enough right now. Uh, chromatic orb. Two chromatic orbs and armor. Three chromatic orbs and armor and two identifies. Okay, that's enough. All right, let's save and see how resting here goes. Spider noises. Okay, that worked. And we rested until fully healed. Uh huh. We're going to cast armor. Excellent. She is now armored. What is her done. armor class now, then? Three. Hell yeah. She's as armored as the uh, monk. Which is not to say very good, but... You know, it's not nothing. I did not mean to pick that up. Alright. Let's go into this cave. Gather your party before venturing forth. Can we... Come on. There we go. A kobold immediately attacks me? Sure did. Dead kobold. Why are you using your sword? I understand. Not a problem. Not a problem. Kobold? Who is this kobold attacking? Imelin? This way. Okay. Success. With ease. Can everyone attack it now, please? Good. With Hello? ease. Um there's a person named Zan over there. Interesting. What's up this way? I guess this is just where they get their water to drink, maybe? Hello, Zan? Who are you? I thank you for my freedom, friends, for I have languished in these dismal vaults too long. What a voice. At last I am free of my dreary prison. Five and eighty days are far too long for one of the fair folk to live as a dwarf. You look no better off than I, but my appreciation for my liberty bids me add my spells to your cause. I am Zan. Shall we face the impossible together? Um, I already have a mage. She's cute. And is a wild mage, which is kind of good, kind of bad. She's also level two. How did you come to be trapped here? 
Alas, I was sent to investigate the strange goings-on about this area, and I landed caged for seemingly hopeless weeks on end. I have not seen the sun almost as long as I have not seen my home. Uh, hang on. <laughs> I'm going to look this up. Okay, let's... Whoa. Jesus Christ, a video started playing. Okay. Ugh. Oof. Ugh. I don't know what sort of visual things may have just happened, but it, it looks fixed, so... Uh... Zan. VGE. If I have him join me... Um, okay, if I have him join and then immediately release him, I can get him again. Yeah, I mean, I, I probably won't ever have him join me, but I don't want to completely miss out on the possibility. So, yeah, you can join. And then I'll immediately remove you. While my stay with you was admittingly fruitless, it has at least been fun. Ah, yes, we've had so much fun together, Zan. Alright, if I ever want to hang out with him, he's still down here in the mines. <laughs> Uh, I rescued an elf named Zan from the mines. He was investigating the problems. I, ac uh, I accepted his offer to join me. Is that literally it? Okay. Cool. Not a problem. What? How do you get in here? It will be done. Um, I don't know. How'd you get in here? I'm gone. No, out of the. Oh my God, Imowen. I stand with ease. Tarzak must have dispatched you, and my traitorous kobolds let you pass, didn't they? I knew I could not trust them. Armed as such, you have obviously been sent to kill me. By Sirik, not a measure of ore leaves these mines unspoiled, and I am still to be executed. I'll not lose my head over this. Um, no one sent us. Reveal thy treachery, and mayhaps we will be merciful. Tarzak did not send thee. Then thou art dead. Help, my minions! Help! Oh, wow. His minions appeared out of nowhere. He's got kobolds and skeletons. When in doubt, kill the guy that has a name. I've done had enough of this. I'll do it. Uh, Jahira cast Bless? Probably should have done that sooner, to be honest. Oh, shit. Stand back and watch this. Chromatic orb. Uh, what happened? What happened? <laughs> okay, he cast Rigid Thinking on Khalid. I hate that. I dealt 18 damage. Jahira failed her spell because she got crit? Or she just took damage? No, okay, Chromatic Orb worked. Okay. Your wish? There sure are a lot of enemies around here. Stand back and watch this. Use another chromatic orb on the skeleton. <coughs> All right, I mm -hmm. I killed the wizard. Rasad's taking some damage. Rasad keeps taking damage, dude. Come on, bro. Khalid is attacking me. Alright, Khalid just... Who did Khalid just kill? A kobold? 
Alright, Khalid's going My to attack to other again. members of our party now. I'd rather task. he didn't. Yes? I shall commit to the task. Yeah, there you go. Alright, all of the enemies can attack Khalid. And then he'll attack them, because he's crazy. Yeah. Excellent. I I turned the slightly mind-controlled guy into my uh, my tank. I'm a genius. What do you want? He's not very good. Okay. I've done had enough of this. He keeps backing up. He doesn't like it. I hope he doesn't kill Zan. Huh. All this missile damage is kind of a I waste. To the task. Oh. He's no longer rich of thinking. Alright. Hmm? Now he's just being pummeled by skeletons. Well, we did it. Not a problem. We cleared the Nashville Mines. Uh, this guy had some boots and a ring and some scrolls. I don't have any room in my inventory. Uh, copy note. All right, let's read this one. My servant Molahe, I have sent you the kobolds and mineral poison that you require. Your task is to poison any iron that leaves these mines. Don't reveal your presence to the miners, or you will find yourself swamped by soldiers from the local Omnian garrison. My superiors have recently hired on the services of the Black Talon mercenaries and the Chill. With these soldiers at my disposal, I should be able to destroy any iron caravans entering the region from the south and east. I don't want to deal with iron coming from the Nashville mines. Do not fail in your duty. Tazok. Okay. Your progress in disrupting the flow of iron ore does not go as well as it should. How stupid can you be to allow your kobolds to murder the miners? With your presence revealed, you should be wary of enemies sent to stop your operation. Your task is a very simple one. If you continue to show that you can't do the job, you will be replaced. I will not send the kobolds you have requested, as I need all the troops I possess to stop the flow of iron into the region. With this message, I have sent more of the mineral poison... If you have any problems, send a message to my new contact in Baragost. His name is Transig, and he's at Feldpost's Inn. Aha! A symbol is... It's a representation of the god Sirik. Uh, Sirik is one of the... He's an evil god that killed Baal. So we, in a previous stream, I read the story about Baal, uh, what's the one that starts with an M? It's Bane, Baal, and Mirkul, the three who took the pro portfolios from the god of death. So there's the god of the dead, there's the god of death, and there's the god of murder or something. Uh, I don't need your armor. I'll take the large shield, though. I'm strong enough. Uh, you shall identify things for us. You can carry the gems. What are these boots? Talos's Gift. All right. I love the fact that they gave names and lore to all of these items. Untold years ago, the fortress of the Starspire Peninsula was placed under the direct torment of Talos when a favored storm herald was murdered there. Talos promised the destruction of the city by earthquakes, its isolation by tidal waves, and the death of its citizens by storms. One pair of these boots was bestowed to ensure that none but a single man would survive to tell the story of his wrath. Later, travelers seeking fortune in the ruined city came upon an aged man, maddened by the continuous destruction around him. The boots he wore would carry to many a distant land the legend of a city consumed by a god's rage. Electrical resistance. <laughs> okay. I'll wear them. Uh, and... Honorary Ring of Sune. Ring of Holiness. 
Rings of this type were given to faithful priests of Sune who demonstrated actions of astounding integrity and kindness. Uh, my druid can use this. She can now memorize additional first level spells. Wouldn't you know it, I'm going to have her memorize Cure Light Wounds because it's the best spell. Speaking of it being the best spell... Cast some cures on people who took damage. I don't need to cast that one yet. Oh yeah, I have a shield that we never identified. Whoopsies. Is there a chest in here? There is. Imowen, is this chest trapped? I look for. I understand. Is good at done. My turn Imowen, what do you think? Today. No? I've done had enough All right, cool. of this. That was a lot of money. So many scrolls. Moonblade plus three. This potent weapon was created by the smiths of ancient myth Draenor. Moonblades are used in the long process of selecting a ruler for the Isle of Evermeet. A moonblade chooses its owner, and in the case of this sword, it has chosen the elf Zan. Only Zan can use this blade. Anyone else who tries will find themselves unable to lift it. Uh, it gives resistance to fire and a bonus to the user's armor class. And it's a dagger. Well, I'll just leave it there. Because <laughs> Zan is stuck here too. Give all of the scrolls to you. Put all of these in our gem bag. See that there is more room in our inventory. Keep looting this. A short sword. I bet this is just a good enchanted short sword, so I'll give it to her, since she likes short swords. Oh, we have a scroll of identify? Alright, screw it. Identify it. It is, in fact, a short sword plus one. It doesn't even have a story. Oh, that's not who I meant to give it to. And scrolls to sell quick save before we try and scribe any of these. No, failed. All right. Go Ryan would be proud and of your actions. Let's load the quick save and try that again. Nope. One more time. What about this one? All right. Success. Quick save. Success. Quick save. Success. All right, cool. We succeeded each time. Uh, Keep those. That's a quest item. Where's the other? Who? Me. I'm going to keep the quest items and scrolls on the mage and all of the gems on Imowen. All of the gems on Imowen, just so I don't forget where they are. Except for the quest item gems. Okay. What did my journal update to? Jur journal. Journal. Hmm? Journal. Important events. Well, okay. Yes. I mean, it will be done. I guess let's leave. Oh, there, there was still a kobold. <laughs> I sure hope I haven't somehow uh, broken the game or anything. It is certain nope. that the death of Malahe will relieve the fears of the terrorized folk of Nashkel. But you remain uneasy. While the half-orc may indeed have caused the evils that befell the mine, the shortage of iron is too widespread to be his doing alone. His letters confirm your suspicions, and though they give little indication as to where his cohorts are hiding, they may have links to the bandits that currently plague the coast way. Oh, okay then. Uh, I should travel to Baragost and pay a visit With to Feldpost Inn and talk to Transig. 
Having plumbed the depths of the Nashville mines, I should return to Baron Gaskill and inform him of the situation. Uh, additionally, I should travel to Baragos to pay a visit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, before we do that, I'm going to quick save. We're going to exit this way. I'm pretty sure the map we're going to pop out on is going to have a very difficult fight on it. Yeah, yeah. I know what map this is. This is not going to be easy. I'm going to use potions for this fight. For certain. Hero literally ready. only has the one spell to use. Okay. With ease. I don't remember where they are. But there's some dangerous people. Who did I cite? Oh. There's just fucking Ankeg down here. Well, we're much stronger now, so let's get him. Got him. 975 experience. That's more than we got in, like, the entire mine. Um, give that to Imowin to put in there. I didn't even know there could be ink eggs down here, to be honest. Oh, this is the top of the map. I am here. There's some hills here. It will be done. Okay. Ah, yep, here we go. This is the hard fight that I know about. Is your name Sir Wombat? Hurry up and answer. Your answer better be the truth, for your life depends upon it. Uh, yeah, what of it? My companion and I have tracked you for many days, and I am to give you a message. You and your friends are to die. Your interference with the Iron Throne... What is this? Game of Thrones? may have caused some minor setbacks, but die knowing that your actions were mostly futile. Alright. Uh -huh. First things first. Lightning bolt. Get her. Shoot her. Move forward. Move down here. Guides my Move down I'll here. Do my Move here. I'll do my best. <laughs> oh, baby. Lightning bolt is good. Get her. Cast chromatic orb. On her. Uh, get Can I her. Attack her. Get her. Hell yeah, Rasad. Now burn her. No! Alright. All right, they keep failing their spells, which is super good for us. What is it this time? Uh, magic missile, this one, just to make sure she dies. All right, that one's dead. All right, in that My case, don't magic day. missile, just get her. No! What is wrong with you, Khalid? I Man, I didn't even have to use try. potions. Okay, they are freaking afraid. Gibbed. None of your spells. Alright, what did she do? Rigid thinking on me? That is bad. I'm dangerous. Stop casting spells. Hold person. God diggity. Damn it. This was going so well. <laughs> You're a queer fellow. I'm gone. All right. That one's dead. Khalid leveled up. Can I immediately level up in combat? Oh, I can. That's going to give him hit points. We can do this. 
He got an additional weapon proficiency. His saves are better. His chance to hit's better. He gained hit points. I can make him better with a longsword, which is what he's using. Or I can make him better with a bow, which would be nice. I could give him sword and shield style, which makes him better against missile weapons. I think I'm gonna make him better with the bow. What you want? I've done had enough of this. Uh, all right, and Emma Wynn succeeded you on that ready? save. I'm going to have you equip your quarter staff and go beat the crap out of her. Oh, and then she put. She commanded Imowen into unconsciousness, but then she woke up. She's attacking Khalid, but I leveled him up. Just get him. Come on. My Screw it. Nira, now you hit her with staff. Alright, she hit Khalid. Jahira dealt a bit of damage. She keeps hitting. Khalid. But I leveled him up, which is why he's alive. Otherwise, he'd be at negative three. Come on. How much health can she have? She still killed Khalid! God damn it! Ah! Son of a bitch. Jesus Christ. F's in chat. Not a problem. I have to try that again. Good grief. That was so disappointing. I thought it was going so well. Uh huh. It will be done. <sighs> All right, I'll take two. No, it's not my name. You lie. Remember what I told you about lying? You were foolish to even try. As my god, Siric allows me to see through all falsehoods. You shall now die. Uh huh. All right. All right. All right. Still lightning bolt her. You move out of the way. 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 All right, there we go. Lightning bolt. Not a problem. Oh, she's near death now. And she failed. Shoot her. Run up to her. What is it this time? Do another lightning bolt on her. As you direct. I can, but try. I am yes. fleeing. It will be done. Uh, Ow. With ease. Okay. 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 I am gone. Okay. We're we're still good. One of them's dead. I'm not sure what lightning damage I took earlier, but it's okay. Get up there, slapper. Please aid me. Okay, she's dead. Did she kill herself? Does that mean I didn't get experience? No! I wanted that experience. I didn't get experience because she killed herself. No. <laughs> I want experience. Uh-uh. Hmm? I refuse. Done. How many times am I doing this? Until it goes right. With ease. <laughs> Rewind. What is this, YouTube? Uh, listen up. I'm not going to tell you my name. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. What's lightning her to begin with? Let's see how that goes. With ease. I understand. If none are better. Um, I don't know if that was a good idea, to be honest, but we'll see. Yes? 
It will be done. Alright. Oh, what? It missed the arrow person? That's not good. Chromatic orb, you. <laughs> You're a queer fellow. Actually, you know what? Move over here. I'm I'm poisoned, apparently. Take your healing potion. I love the revive. And you took a bunch of damage from... What did you take a bunch of damage to? Electricity from Zila? Who is Zila? That's Zila? Zila's the other spellcaster? I don't know what's happening. This one might be going worse. You need to move. You need to move. I just killed Khalid. <laughs> Alright. That was our worst attempt yet. With ease. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Not a problem. I'm gonna quickly save here. I made Khalid. Oh no. <laughs> Big F. Biggest F. Khalid has died every time. Kind of. I guess there was that one time that the spellcaster lady killed herself. Stand but... back and watch this. What if I have if everyone approach from this way except for my awesome lightning bolt lady? I'll do it. Uh, no, fuck you. Okay, lightning bolt, go. And everyone just rush, go done. forward, get her. Yes, okay. Okay, I hit two of them that time. We're just gonna lightning bolt again. Stop that spellcaster. I'm poisoned mm -hmm. again. That's not good. Your wish. Uh, run up to her. I shall to the All right, that I'll one's dead. As soon as possible. This one's almost dead. Khalid says he's at seven out of twenty-six. Drink a potion. Excellent. Uh huh. Right. Get her, get her, get her. Please. Oh God. <laughs> I don't like that lightning bounces everywhere. Kill her. Stand back and watch. I could really use Tensor's floating bandage over here. I am not well and not a problem. Kill her. I'm gonna dive poison. I, I don't wanna well. dive poison. And Rasad's dead. This fight is so hard. I knew it was hard. It went so well the first time and the second time. And then it didn't. Alright, so I was a little it too far done. south for the uh the lightning bolt. Stand back and watch this. Uh, fuck you, lightning bolt. I might be too far north now. With ease. You know what? Let's use our bows first. Just everybody fucking shoot her. Okay. Gosh, she didn't even take that much uh -huh. that time. But as long as... Okay. That outright, what just, why did, what? <laughs> Khalid took 21 damage. Ah! Why is everything going horribly this time? This is gonna work. Alright. I'm not quitting. I'll do it. Clearly, interrupting the second spellcaster seems to be important. Alright, lightning bolt. Hmm? Everyone else fucking rush the second girl. Get her. Get her. Oh my god! It's gonna kill my mage. I'll do it. Huh. I really oh, it did it! She only took seven! Over here. Why did it jump that way? I am I'm poisoned again. No! No! What even spell did she cast? Glyph of Warding. Okay. Um. What is. Do that. Go. Go kill her with fire. I shall commit to the task. I'm taking a lot of damage from poison. It would be really embarrassing if we still died to poison. Okay, she's dead. Kill her. I am not well at all. 
Okay, Khalid leveled up again. I stand I'm still ready. doing very poorly. Cast a heal on him. Uh, rigid thinking happened. Can we just kill these people? No! Khalid died again! Oh, that one was so close. Are you kidding me? Jump cut for YouTube? Nuh uh. This is too entertaining. Wait. No. Uh oh, this one's just not gonna go well at all. Everyone flee! <laughs> Ooh, what if I have them waste their spells? Uh huh. I'll do it. Like they start casting and then I move. Hello. Um. Hello. Hello. Where did they go? <laughs> what has happened? Uh oh. Oh. Okay. Get her. Yeah, can't do shit if you can't see me. Uh. Um. Oh, uh-oh. Get. Get. Flee. Flee. I am poisoned. Oh, she's just gonna fuck. Yeah, she doesn't have enough health to withstand that. That might work, though. I'm gonna try that. Fuck it. And watch this. Uh. No, fuck you. Everyone just run. Not a problem. Just run. Stand right. back and right. watch right. this. Okay. Right. Lightning bolt. Flee. That lightning bolt was dangerous. Alright. Alright. Okay. Try it again. Where'd they go? Okay. There's one. Get her. Oh. Only take me to oh a no. What a what a death cry. Only take me to a licensed cleric. Yes, I could theoretically get her resurrected out of town, but that costs money and we lose experience and I'm not doing it. Okay. I think just getting off one free one, though, is probably I'll good enough, it. right? And then I can send everyone else in. Oh. Listen up. Fuck you. Flee! It will be done. I'll do it! Okay, they're casting spells. Uh, it didn't work. I resisted it. All right, all right, all right. That's one spell just down the... Can I save? I can save. This game is silly. I'm definitely uh, cheesing it. Yeah, fuck off. Fuck off. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. Can I save again? This lightning bolt wand, first of all, is the only reason this is even possible. Get her. Can I save again? <laughs> this is silly. Hello? Lightning bolt! Alright, I, I killed two of them. And I saved versus that spell again. Wait, did I kill three of them? I see three corpses over there. I've killed three of them. Mm -hmm. Save? How about now? How about now? Okay, yeah. well, there's only one left. Not a problem. How about now? I can save. All right, fucking get her. Kill this last one. All right, she is a spellcaster, and she's uninjured. Fucking rush her, Khalid. I mean, Rasad. You beautiful Kalashite. Get her. Yes, spellcasting failure. Murder her! Rannic Orb. My turn to save the day. Attack her, please. Uh-huh. Spellcasting failure, yes. Stand back and Oh my god, we did it. With ease. Alright. That I may I might not be proud of the way that combat went. But I'm proud of my ability to cheese the game so that I can kill these people at a time when I shouldn't be able to. Oh my god. Alright.
Level up. <laughs> Thank you for those emotes, Gary. This is the sort of time where I agree. I deserve that. Oh, man. Poggers. Nature servant what do they have? Some free plate mail. A boring-ass mace. Okay. Some splint mail. A magical sword. Ooh. Okay. Well, first off, I'm carrying too much. Splint mail isn't even worth that much. Khalid, that's too much for you. Alright, the monk can carry that. Some more arrows to identify. I know that they're fire arrows. I'm just going to give them to Khalid. But these... A potion of power. It effectively increases their level. Interesting. Another potion of stone form. That doesn't sound very good, to be honest. I think I'll probably sell that one. Got potions of invisibility that I n I'm never going to use those. And what about... It will be done. Are the, all of their bodies here? Yeah, there we go. Some darts. She never even got to throw any of the darts. That's how good I am. Potion of magic blocking. Immunity to spells of 5th level and below. If there's a fight where I keep getting charmed, that's what I'll use. Oil of fiery burning. Imelin, you take that. I trust you. That's a fireball in a bottle. And that's just a long... I mean, longbows are worth money. I'll pick it up. Okay. Not a problem. Now we keep exploring, I guess. Now that the big fight that is dangerous is over with. Fucking hell. My heart is still a little, uh, elevated. How many times did I use that wand? Three? So I, I still have another fight's worth of that lightning bolt wand that I can do. Pretty sure there can't be anything to the east of here, since we're this far on the map. Yep, Not we are the farthest east on the map you can go. Uh, <laughs> that's a kobold. Oh boy. On a part of the map I already explored, which is moderately annoying. Come on, guys. Just stop. Come on. on you, We're done fighting day. kobolds now. Kobolds are like the uh, minion enemies in 4th edition Dungeons & Dragons. They only have one hit point and they're only there to waste your time. should definitely have been holding down tab this whole exploration time because I feel like there's going to be a secret little nook and cranny somewhere. 
like where I got my sweet ring that oh who are you what kind of experiment are you attempting Narcilicus Harwilliger Neen I believe I have developed a spell to emphatically control any gelatinous creature and bend it to your will. Slimes, jellies, oozes, all of these things that foul the cook's cellar and the adventurer's dungeon can now be controlled and eradicated with an ease and efficacy never before seen in the history of the realms. It takes an entire hour to gain such control, but that time will be minimized with further experimentation, I am sure. In moments, that hour will be up for a small number of mustard jellies that I have released into the nearby woods. We shall soon bear witness to the results of my endeavor. You must write this spell down. I have worked years for this, and you seek its benefits in mere seconds? You will not seek them. The spell is mine. Come, jellies, let us make our mark upon the world. S Seriously, dude? <laughs> Whoa, that was worth 1,400 experience. All right, let's save. I don't even know where his jellies are, to be honest. Probably just off screen. Can I get another Poggers? Ooh, M1 can be better with a single weapon style? I can make her good with a crossbow. Thank you for the Pogs, guys. I can make her better with a long sword, but she has a plus one short sword. I guess I'll go with single weapon style for now. She's already pretty good at finding traps. I'd like her to be better at opening locks. So I'm curious. Armor class is two. Armor class is still two because of single weapon style. But if she equips the shield then it's from the buckler. All right, so single weapon style it is. She no longer needs a buckler. Um, I have saved. It Let's move forward. Done. Would you look at that? Mustard jellies. I think they're immune to non-magical damage, so we're going to have to go hit them with uh, magic weapons. But just to be sure, uh, Imelin, try and shoot one. Oh, Jahira leveled up too. Shit. Level up. Her thack was reduced. She got uh, level 2 spells. Uh, and she can be better with a weapon. I'll make her even better with a quarterstaff or even better with a sling. I think even better with a sling. That's what she's usually using. And give her level 2 spells so she can learn her own good berry, which is boring and stupid. Slow poison. It neutralizes most. I don't need find traps, charm person, or mammal. Maybe charm person? That seems fine. I don't really like any of the others. Sure. All right, meanwhile, your coach. wish. Go. Excuse me? Rasad was just critically hit for 30 damage? What? All right, I'll do those level ups in a moment. The fuck? <laughs> Excuse you. Wait, can she still have this? Yeah, she'll equip it. Okay. Big oof. Big, big, big oof. Oh, and now there's a, there's a skeleton sighted down there? I don't want to... No. 
What? What, these? what is happening? Stop. Fuck off. Skeletons? Why are there skeletons? What is this place? I don't remember anything about this map except for the fight with the bounty hunters. Man, Jihira using that quarterstaff is interesting. I usually do not have her do such things. Alright, cool. Dead skeletons. It will be done. They had darts. With ease. Skeletal darts. Alright, save. Now the skeletons are dead. The group. I just want to. I can, but Dude, try. 30 damage I is can, too much. Alright. Get that jelly. Kill it. Yeah, okay. Weapon ineffective. Yeah, so you have to use magical weapons. Magic resistance? Excuse you? Can they just not take damage from piercing then? Does it not have to be magical? Your I shall commit to the task. <clears throat> okay, how much What okay, what is affecting me now? Slow? Okay, whatever, that's fine. Dude, mustard jellies are dangerous. Do you think they could take damage from lightning? If this doesn't go well, I'm gonna try the lightning thing. Okay, they are immune to stabbing. I am prepared. Okay, use your fists. Um, Imowen, don't I'm be there. I'm interested if Khalid can do anything. Okay. Wombat, Jahira. Okay, they can all do things. I guess it's just because those are only stabs. Okay, now I'm actually poisoned. Does Jahira have that spell? No? Alright, healing potion it is. Alright. I mean, this isn't so bad when they don't you know, crit one shot the monk. Hmm? Two thousand experience per? Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you're slow in taking damage from poison. We'll see if you need to take a potion or not. I'm hoping you won't. Okay, yeah, he didn't. Who, baby? All right, well now we can yeah, finally we loot this done. wizard. He's got a scroll of lightning bolt, so when my mage can finally cast it, that'll be cool. Her inventory's full. Oh my god. Um. Give the coal to Jahira. Yes. Scroll sent to the scroll box. Quick save. Learn this spell. She failed. That's why we quick save. Oh, yeah. I should do those level ups, too. All right. There we go. All right. Let's do those level ups again. I don't have to think about it as hard. Poison, charm person. Not a problem. Do you have any more heals? No, I don't hmm? want to. Uh huh. Okay, it will whatever. be done. Oh yeah, there's a fucking crypt here. I feel like I have to wait for that slow to go away. Screw it, we're just gonna rest. You were startled Ugh. out of sleep with a chill, though the night is warm and calm. 
It is though someone has walked across your grave, and for a moment, you wonder if it was you. What? With this thought, the ground beneath you opens, and you are swept into the dark. Is that me walking over my grave? When light returns, you do not find its presence comforting. Before you lay the empty mines of Nashkel, cleansed by your previous passage, you move through walls and floors alike, descending deeper and deeper, until a bloated figure comes into view. Mullahe, in no better shape than you left him, stands motionless before you. Held from whatever afterlife calls it, this foul apparition has been waiting for you. A dagger of bone hovers before it, ready for a willing hand to drive it deep. Had this creature breath, you were sure it would be hurling curses. It waits for the kill, a death beyond death, and knows no hope. You turn your back on the blade, and it clatters to the floor. Punishment enough shall find this creature in the land of the dead. You need not inflict any more upon him. Surprised and thankful, the visage of Mullahe hobbles forward and through you, off to whatever fate it deserves. Perhaps for safekeeping, it leaves a part of itself behind. It is a spark of hope that fills a space within you. A dagger-shaped hole you did not know was empty. There is a cry of rage from the depths, and the dagger of bone launches itself through the air. Your heart, its target. You awake just as it should have struck, and the cold sweat that covers you stings your eyes. A disapproving voice lingers in your ears, though it should have disappeared with the dream. You will learn. I think that these cutscenes, like the first time that you rest after finishing a chapter sort of cutscenes, are based on the morality of your group and if you are being evil or not evil. And I'm not being evil, so I didn't punish the ghost. And I gained the ability to cast Cure Light Wounds. Two of them, in fact. Wow. And we rested for 16 whole hours. That's a lot of hours. Got our spells back. I would like... What do I want to identify first? The robes, probably. Knave's robes. A favorite among mage thieves. It's been enchanted to shield its wearer from the blades and poisons. Plus one armor class versus slashing attacks. No, I much prefer versus missile attacks. I guess we could keep it and swap out, but meh. Some enchanted studded leather armor. Just plus one studded leather. Hell yeah, there you go, Imowen. Armor class from three to two. And when she's using her sword, one. It's better than the monk. Certainly better than the mage. Um, well, that's all my Identify spells, right? It is. Okay. I probably should have changed that, but what are you going to do? Not all right, and we problem. go. Ghasts, huh? No! Khalid is diseased? Nauseated? I don't know what that does. No! Dude, come on, bro. You've got a good armor class. You run the best, and now he's held. God damn it, Khalid. How useless can you be? Khalid, bro. I swear, if your wife wasn't here to cast healing spells on you, you'd be dead. He is dead. I swear. He's not even that bad of a character. He just seems to have the worst luck. All right, let's try that again. He's got a plus two sword. With ease. You know what? Khalid's going to have the magical shield. Hmm? right he 
got held again. God diggity doobles. You're weak. Yeah, just keep casting on your stupid husband. You guys not gonna shoot it? Come on. All right, there we go. What were they holding? Gems, jewels. Yes, with ease. That last one not even holding anything? No, it was. A golden ring. Give all that stuff to the thief. Let's save. Not a problem. Do we think these might be trapped? Oh, everyone's encumbered. How are you encumbered? Oh. Now you're encumbered. Now you're encumbered, and I can't. Whatever. I've done had enough of this. These coffins trapped. No. Okay. A wand. A ring. What is this? A potion of frost giant strength. 21 strength for two hours. Good to know. Some armor that's too heavy. Too heavy. Okay, that, that'll do. That'll do. And now you can carry the rest. We don't need that buckler. It's worth like one gold. With ease. All right. Um, let's leave. With ease. Oh, Kalid is still kind of encumbered. Just barely. You don't need that shield. You don't need that sword. You don't need this mace. I don't know. You kind of do, though. Do you, though? Give it to the monk? Yeah, okay. There we go. It will be done. Quick save. Not a problem. Ooh, I should change the title of my stream. I'm no longer underground. And that is out of the mines. What's up this pathway? Nothing? It's nothing. This one map has given us like four times the experience that the Nashville Mines did. <laughs> Maybe even more, to be honest. It was 5,200 from the mage and his jellies, and then maybe 3,000 from oh, some wild dogs. Oh, Lord. Whatever will we do? No, Gary, I changed the title, and now I'm out of the mines. I'm never going back in there, unless I decide I want Xan for some reason. But I don't think he has a quest, so... No can do. Ooh. I found another... Uh, like, Barrow Den? There's a Revenant in here. I think Khalid is slow because he's diseased. Lost. Not a problem. Even. Thief will pay with death. Return, return the dagger. Uh, die. No. Weapon in effect. Ow! 16 dick. Khalid! None are better. Uh, I think I have to use a magic weapon against this guy. I'll do my best. Uh, who's the Revenant attacking now? Rasad. He's got health. All right, he doesn't I anymore. I understand. 
sure Emily's got health. Okay, now she doesn't. Khalid no longer has health. Can you guys just kill it, please? That was worth 3,000, and now our mage is level 3. Good grief, this place is worth a lot. I don't even have a dagger to give you, dude. Alright. Level up. Level 2 mage spells. Is a good time. She only knows... Okay, so Chaos Shield. Uh, it increases her chance for her wild surges to be good. So I'm going to then raise one of those. Honestly, two of those, because I'm never, ever going to use web. Okay. Well, we're alive. With ease. Quick save. What was that? What is that noise? Why is that noise happening? Hello? With ease. It will be done. Okay. I don't know why that noise was happening. Also, what dagger was I supposed to return? We're also all very injured. I guess I can cast some more heal spells. And by all, I mean Khalid and Imowin. Kind of healed up. I guess we'll save now that we're healed. Oh, I should. That's an ogre. Just, just a straight up ogre. Ogre berserker. I look forward to your instruction. Everyone, please swap to your missile weapons. Nature servant awaits. Your way. I shall Let's not have to you the in task. front. I'll do it. guides my hand. Okay. Uh huh. My turn to save the day. I understand. I am not well at all. Damn, dude. It will be done. How long am I gonna have to rest out in the wilderness? Cause I, I've rested twice on this map already, and I'm still gonna fucking die. Yes, it will be done. Cast all the healing spells I can. That was only a single Ogre Berserker here, for some reason. What dagger was that guy talking about? I can probably... Uh, who are you? Hentold? I, I will save you, Hentold. Help! Help! Please, no. Don't let them get me. Don't kill me. I'm so sorry. I'll give it back. Just don't kill me. Oh. What, is this the guy that took the freaking dagger that I didn't know about? Tell me what your problem is. My problem is the horrible death we're plaguing my mind. I cannot concentrate. I'll give it back. Uh. Okay. There was a grave. Take this dagger to the tomb. All right. Hmm, not a problem. Just kobolds. Ooh. Oh, was that sound just thunder? With ease. I'm gonna save. I said I'm gonna save. Not a problem. Save, please. There we go. Okay. So if I had encountered that guy before going in there, I would have had the option to give him a dagger. With ease. What dagger do I have? Some sort of dagger. Okay. I'll identify it when I can. Problem. I don't really want to rest again. I just did. There was another cave connected to that one somehow. Like they were on the same map. Was it just the ghoul cave? 
Had I already been in it? I feel like it wasn't, but maybe. Exploring. Oh, here we go. Maybe, maybe this is the one. Well, do I go in with two hit points? I'm gonna go in two hit points. It's a single ghoul. Oh, okay, yeah, they all are on the same map. I've been to each of them. Well, I don't like that I'm next no to it. Problem. I can, but try. It will be done. Whoa. Oh, that was just a ghoul. Oh, hell yeah. The monk leveled up. This has been a very productive two hours of Baldur's Gate. All right. He can never be better with these weapons. I can make him good with a sling. I can make him good with single weapon style. I think that's what I'll do. Well, he can get good with a sling later. Yeah, definitely. At 5th level, he gets Flaming Fists. His fists turn into flaming weapons that deal extra damage. But only for a round. At 6th level, he gets another use of his Sun Soul Ray. I think his Sun Soul Ray currently does... a lot. And Undead Creatures take more. Okay. Okay. What about his unarmed strike damage? Does that ever increase? Right, what's his damage when he equips nothing? A d8 plus one with his fists versus a d8 plus one plus one when he's using that. All right, yes. so uh, he should only ever use his fists. Yeah, the same thing. Money. Okay, it well, it looks done. like I've explored all the tombs without having to rest. I would really like a magical two-handed weapon. So I don't have to swap to that plus two lightning hammer. Wowee. All right, back to Nashville with us. I could explore, you know, more, but I don't want to. Not a problem. Um, is this the house with the lady whose husband had the the ring? I think it is. It will be done. Hello there. We found a green stone ring, but I think he's dead. We're very sorry. Have his ring. And a free 800 experience a and a good deed. With ease. That's good. I think I might be attacked by another bounty hunter here, but it's only a single person. So I think we can handle it. There's Minsk again. Minsk, I'm not helping you right now. Hello, Ublek. I've come to turn in a bounty. Got some experience. Uh, what bounties are unclaimed? Alright, I can go get Brig if I want. Alright, cool. Uh, there's Baron Gastkill. Hey, I did the thing in the mines. You've returned. It would seem I was right to trust you. The town thinks you're wholeheartedly. It's pleased to give you a proper reward. Please take this 900 gold. I've also found this vial of liquid on one of the kobolds. I think it has something to do with the iron. Show that to Thunderhammer. Okay. Alright, I got some more reputation. 
cool. The store where I can Perhaps finally sell things. No, I am death come for thee. Surrender, and thy passage shall be quicker. Uh, I'm not surrendering anything. Okay. Okay, bye, Gary. Okay. Get him? Yes, O oh, omnipresent authority figure. Right, he mirror imaged, not a fan. He almost did. He did. Not a problem. The money you received from Transig should cover your usual fee. It's a difficult one. I'm sure that you're up to the task. There's a group of mercenaries who should be coming through Nashgul in the next few days. They're led by a whelp named Sir Wombat. You are to kill Sir Wombat and all that travel with them. That might not look like much, but they're dangerous and good hunting. Okay. My inventory is full yet again. Good grief. He had some normal throwing axes. Copy note. All right. I stand ready. Ooh, do we have identify again? I can't remember. We do not. Okay. Uh, my journal was updated by an assassination attempt. Someone was hired to kill me. I don't know why anyone wants me dead. Dude, it's pretty... With we ease. know... It's signed Tazok. Clearly, I'm doing things that these evil people don't want me doing. My character's an idiot. Right, I want to change my settings so I do not rest until healed. Because hmm? I want to do a lot of identifying. With ease. With ease. So. Ooh, find familiar. Quick save. What does that even do? It can only be cast by the protagonist. Well then, sell it. Uh, spells, forget all of these. Only learn identify. You. Not a problem. I would like to rest in your noblest room. And now we're going to identify a bunch of things. Some leather armor plus protector of the second. The mist, the mist of Shadows were an elite group of elven rangers that roamed the Cormanther Wood and were the bane of bandits and monsters alike. This particular armor was worn by Indira Lakin, one of the group's most highly decorated officers and second in command. The suit is named for her, though how it came to part her company is unknown. Oh, she was murdered. So, Imowen could wear either. And they're the same. I'm not sure which one sells for more. Uh, identify this longsword. Harrower. This double-edged longsword gleams white even in the reddest of torchlight. The Deathek runes along its sides name the blade Harrower, a weapon once wielded by Arabelle, a water Davian paladin of Lathander, who once carried the weapon into combat against the vampire Xerifex and her host of Unholy Spawn. Ariabel did not survive the contest, but decades later, a gang of Tethyrian tomb robbers recovered her sword from the crypt where she fell. Uh, it's just a plus one longsword, but it's really good against undead. So Khalid can hold it for when he fights undead. Okay. Next, identify this dagger that we were supposed to return to that revenant and didn't. Heart of the Golem. There are no record of this weapon's creator. Nevertheless, its existence can be traced back among thieves and murderers to before Dale Reckoning. Wow, that's like 1300 or more years ago in this game. Its blackened blade was apparently forged from the arcane metals of an iron golem. 
giving the weapon an appearance as dark as its history. It's just a dagger. Plus two dagger, but just a dagger. I will give that to her to use instead of her shitty staff that hurts her. I think I'll always keep it because it's hers and maybe she'll make it better over time. Identify these darts. Dart of wounding. This dart is coated in a deadly poison that will immediately seep into the bloodstream of striking an opponent with very deadly results. They have to save versus death or take 20 points of poison damage in 20 seconds. So that's what was horribly poisoning me in that difficult fight that I cheesed. Uh, I think we'll probably just sell that, to be honest. None of us are good at darts. Chainmail plus one. I don't even think that's as good as plate mail. Plate mail is three. This is four. Yeah, it's not even as good as plate mail. Two versus slashing, six versus crushing, versus zero versus slashing. Yeah, it's just better. Uh, so we'll sell that one. I don't need this lump of coal anymore. It's too heavy for most of you to carry. Who was holding it? Was I holding it? Oh, I was. Um, what about these boots? Senses of the cat. The magic of these boots was specifically designed to detect incoming missiles and aid the wearer in avoiding them. They were originally commissioned by the instructor of an archery academy who had tired of suffering accidents at the hand of his inexperienced students. Awesome. So I can increase someone's armor class to missile weapons. I think the mage should have that. She'll often get attacked by missile weapons, I feel. But... I often charge into battle, and so does Khalid. I'll give him to Khalid. Wow, that's too heavy for you, huh, Khalid? God damn it, dude. You're such a wimp. You're weaker than the monk. And we are now out of identify spells. Which means we will rest again. Oh, but first I'm going to cast all my healing spells. Back to identifying. This is just another plus one short sword. Topsider's Crutch. Merchants that dare the risks of trading with the drow of the Great Rift are often given these items to aid in their movements underground. Gives them crazy improvision. Don't care. Selling it. A wand of monster summoning. It'll summon 12 hit dice of monsters, which appear within the area of effect and attack my enemies. If no opponent exists, they can perform other services. What does that mean? How many charges does it have? Eight? Okay. Uh, what else is there to identify? Shield. And the arrows. Arrows of fire plus two, so more of them. Some plus two arrows. And a small shield plus one. Alright. I know I I know that I'll need that skull at some point. I just don't remember when. She's never gonna use that club again. Wow, we're running low on bullets.
Okay. Uh, how many identify spells do I have left? Oh, I, I literally used them all? Did I really? Doesn't feel like I did, but maybe I did. Okay. I'm in armor again, chromatic orb twice, and one reckless dwemer, which we will use with chaos shield. Um, I don't really want to rest. Ooh, I'm gone. we're better at picking locks. Can I steal? Heck yeah. Heck yeah. That's how you know you advanced your party. Oh, hello. Um. Okay, there's nothing in it. Yes, hey. not a problem. Can we please? Can we exit the building? Come on, guys. Definitely one of the done. worst things about this game. Oh, hey, Agantis is still standing there. Who is Taris? about him this tall and oh, this wide have you that lout excuse me i don't i don't know what this is i can't help you oh you haven't seen okay. a man about him this tall and oh, this wide have you that who, is, lout. who are you what is that what is that what is that terrace <laughs> Oh, okay. She has something to do with uh, Dorn. That uh, half work blackguard guy. Alright, I can sell him things. I don't know. Splint mail for 16? I feel like I could get a better deal in Baragast. And he doesn't have anything I want, that's for sure. I'll sell the longbow. Studded leather for nine. Man, I just don't think it's worth it. Plus two leather armor for only 1750 I feel like Thunderhammer Smithy's gotta have better it will deals. Be done. It will be done. Plus, he has that ankeg armor that I want, and I can sell this current ankeg shell to him. Back to Baragost with us. Traveled for 12 hours. Ritual heal juggler. There it we go. Be done. Oh, that wonder. Oh. Stay thy course a moment to it's that old man that we met, like, one day out of Candlekeep. Who, his name is now Elminster, according to the, the box. Well now, our paths cross once more. I suppose proper introductions are in order, as we will no doubt meet again. My name is Elminster. I've heard nothing but tales of thy exploits in the time we have been apart. It would seem that you're destined to have quite the impact on the Sword Coast. Quite the burden for one so young. Uh, I was not aware that my actions were common knowledge. Perhaps not common knowledge, but everything is plain for those that know where to look. As it is, I am aware of thine efforts and accomplishments. Thou art quite adept, as Gorion predicted. All that remains is to determine motive. Y you knew my dad? Twas neither the place nor the time for such things. As painful as the circumstances may have been, it was time for thee to forge thine own path. One of the most valuable lessons that life has taught me is when not to go sticking my pipe in other people's affairs. Such is the case now as well. But you could tell me so much. I fear I cannot. Self-discovery is best left to the self, and all thy questions will be answered in time. I will offer a small tidbit of information. Though thou hast likely heard the same from another source already, the bandits that thou dost seek make a habit of traveling in the northeast. A search in that direction will no doubt yield fruitful results. Cool. 
All who walk the realms know of this man. Though what he should find of interest in me, I don't know. I mean, I've killed dangerous stuff. Not Thunderhammer! You old so-and-so. Give me that armor. Heck yeah. Cool. Armor class 1. Minus 2 versus slashing. 0 versus piercing and missile. Versus shitty plate mail. I actually didn't know it was that good. I wasn't ever paying attention. I thought it was just plate mail. Not a now I'm green. Uh, Alright, and I will sell you the ink egg shell that I have. I found this vial on one of the kobolds lurking in the mines. I think it might be what's causing the iron to break. You found it, just like that. Well, that certainly does illuminate things, doesn't it? I thought maybe you could use it to find a way to reverse the effects? I couldn't, no. But I know someone who can. Give me a few days and I should have some results. You should return to him in a couple of days to see if he's found a way to reverse the effects of the kobold's poison. Uh, yeah, this guy already has better prices. Oh, not for studded leather, though. Should have sold it back in Nashville. It's a difference of eight gold, though. Should I sell the stupid stupefier? I don't use it. I'm going to sell it. Alright, the protector of the second is still worth the same. These stupid gloves. I swear I, there's somewhere I can sell them as like a curiosity and it's worth it. The knave's robe is worth 300 here. Was it not worth more in Nashkel? Shit. I mean, I don't care that much about money. Do you have a plus two two-handed sword or a plus one two-handed sword I can buy? Oh, I should buy more bullets. Got some plus one shields I could buy. Full plate armor is the equivalent of. Dude, shadow armor plus three. What is it? Studded leather? It's plus three studded leather that was made for the Shadow Masters of Om. It increases the height and shadows ability. The army of Sith? Scythe? The army scythe? Short lived outpost of humans in the frozen forest unearthed this weapon. It lets you attack an extra attack per round. And a dagger of venom. But no good two-handed swords. I swear. Well, la-dee-da. Uh, I should buy more bullets. Should I buy any plus one bullets? I mean, I have the money. And it'd be nice for my mage to be able to damage things that are resistant to magic without casting a spell. I'll buy some. And then I'll buy... a bunch of bullets. We don't need any more arrows. We picked up a bunch of those. Bullets. Bullets. We have plenty of arrows. Oh, I was going to check the difference between those two armors for sale. More bullets. More bullets. You have the plus bullets. Arrows. We don't have any magical bows. That would be nice. What is this one? Potion of Freedom. Makes you immune to stuff that slows you. Eh, probably won't ever use it, to be honest, but I won't get rid of it. Oh. Definitely need to sell all of those. With ease. 
Um, oh, okay. This plus two leather armor is worth more. So it's a higher level of magic. So I will sell that. Pearl, gem, gem. Oh, he doesn't buy necklaces? Hmm. He does not buy jewelry. He only buys gems. I guess that makes sense. Gems, then. Wow, there aren't that many. Wow. Hmm. Done. I stand ready. It will be done. All right, cool. With ease. I'm cool hmm? looking now. Actually, I might be a little silly looking. Sir Wombat, Sir Wombat, someone in the Jovial Juggler gave me a gold piece to come find you. Uh, how do you know my name? Everyone here is talking about you. You're the ones who saved the Nashville Mines. My mama says that even though we don't like those folks from Om, there's no reason anyone should have to suffer. Alright. I feel like it's probably bad, but I'll go to the Jovial Juggler. Maybe it's not bad. Maybe it's fine. Can I assist you? Officer Vi. Sir Wombat, I thought it might be you. These southern parts are set quite afire with talk of your work in Nashkel. I am Officer Vi of the Flaming Fist, and to be honest, I could use your help. Uh, I'm honored to found worthy of your notice. How may I be of assistance? My contingent and I are cut off from Baldur's Gate. We haven't received new orders for close to a week, and to be honest, I don't like the feel of this at all. The bandit raids have been getting worse since you returned from Nashville. I used to think they were just your usual brigands out to make a quick buck, but not anymore. They're working for someone. One way or another, I've got to get my troops back to the gate. I'll pay 50 gold pieces for every bandit scalp you can bring me, and spread the news. I want this whole region cleared. Not a problem. Bandit scalps. All right. Can I assist you? Cool. This isn't the inn. What's the name of the one I'm supposed to go Not to? Feldpost Inn. Where's that? Burning Wizard. There's Feldpost Inn. Not a problem. Oh, and there's totally. I think it's this house. Double check in. Yeah. I'm supposed to talk to a lady and say, oh, yeah, your husband's fine, but the messenger died. Um. Is this the bartender that has things he can sell me? You want some whiskey? He is. He's got a plus one battle axe. Ooh, a composite longbow plus one that Khalid cannot use. Traces of defense eight. The plus one shields. Some spells and a bunch of shit that I've already sold to him. The protector. Amulet of protection plus one. The royal guard of King Pyronan, ruler of Impulter. Okay, that's very far to the east. We're given the protector as an honorary show of status. Members of the guard had trouble coming to a consensus amongst themselves as to whom the amulet should go. After years of internal hostility, the item was lost and the guards were placed by less greedy individuals. It's a plus one amulet. It's honestly pretty good. I have 11,000 gold to spend. I don't know if I want to spend it on an amulet, though. I kind of want that shadow armor. It will be done. There's Transig. There's Algernon. Ooh. Do you think I could steal from him yet? I've done had enough of this. Hidden Shadow succeeded. Nope. Alright, it didn't work. Try one more time. I'm gone. 
One more time. Fine. With ease. Let's kill this guy. Seems to me like these men want a little trouble. Yeah. Your wish? Tilune guides my hand. Seems Not a problem. Like men want a little trouble. I'll give them trouble. Why do you bother me? Can't you see that I'm in a hurry to get out this downtown? Uh, perhaps you could tell us why you're in such a hurry? I'm not going to tell you guys anything. Get out of my face. Uh, you won't be rid of us that easily. You know what I'm up to, eh? Well, maybe something you don't know about is my magic skills. You might not believe me, but <laughs> if you ain't out of my face in the next five seconds, I'll blast you to kingdom come. You, wielding magic, we can't suspend our disbelief that much. Come along now and surrender, or we'll have to hurt you. We're not afraid of any mage. If you want to fight, bring it on. I warned you! Okay. Well. Goodbye. It's a shame, really. C uh, can I help you? Oh no. He did. Not a problem. He had a note. I am perplexed as to why Molahe has not communicated with us in some time. You are to go to the mines and find out the condition of his operation. You are also to collect any iron that may have been stolen by the kobolds. Our next raid will most likely take place at Peldvale or Larswood. Visit either of those areas, track us back to our camp. Okay, interesting. Glitter dust. Huh. Identify stuff. I can't. Yet. But okay. Hmm? I should travel to Larswood or Peldvale. It appears that the bandit attacks come from there and are related to the iron shortage. There should be a base hidden away somewhere in the forests. Not a problem. Can I steal from this yet? Oh, it's already empty. All right, quick save. I've done had enough of this. Damn it. I just want his cloak. This way. Damn it. I'm never going to get his cloak. What Whatever, I don't need it. It just increases your charisma. It will be done. It will be done. So I could go continue the story. I could. Or. Hear me out. What if I didn't? <laughs> what if I just explored places? I never went to the carnival. Well... I kind of want to save the captain of the guard. And I don't think I ever even explored all of this area. I think I just went there and killed the cleric to get the money to make the NK armor. You have been waylaid by enemies. I've been waylaid by kobolds. Good grief. Nature's servant awaits. They dead. They had gems. Darkness falls and nature sleeps. Why do we still I'll trouble do my about? Best. Well, do you not like traveling at night, Jahira? Not a problem. Your Ryan would be proud of your actions. Thanks, Khalid. Yeah, I never finished exploring this area. Let's do it. It'll be easier now. Your wish? Huh, you're a queer fellow. 
hardy Can't individuals. Better armor class, better to hit. A wolf! Those used to be scary. That wolf is... Oh, hello. Chicken. Thank you. You saved me. I fear I've taken one too many blows to the head. Next time, I'll be hearing hamsters speak. Heh. <laughs> Reference to Minx and Boo. Thank you, yes. Quack. That was just what I needed in my hour of need. You laugh it up while I learn to cope with passing eggs. Uh. Okay, what's up? Thank the mother of all magic. Mayhaps now I might end this nightmare. I am Melicamp of Baragost, a mage adept in the mystical arts. A misread incantation seems to be the source of my troubling form. It has been over a month since I uttered a polymorph spell, and I simply cannot return to my normal form. Is there anyone that might be able to help you? Blast it all. There's nothing else I can do except my most hated option. There's a tower directly to the west of Baragost, about which can be found the mage Thalantir. I am his apprentice, and I am certain he will aid me. You don't really seem that certain. Oh, tis nothing. Really? Often the relationship between apprentice and master is strained. He will help, I am certain. Okay. Hmm? I have gained a Melicamp the chicken. Please. Speak up. Kissick, no, stay back, lest this madness be catching. Uh, calm down. What are you talking about? Oh, I found a chicken. He was talking about Melicamp. I too found a chicken. He's in my bag. Okay. My training did not prepare me for such extended activity. Oh, he tired. That's okay. We'll deal with that later. That's a bear. Cave bear. Shoot it. Just riddle it with arrows and bullets. Alright, alright. Use the sword. Nah, you didn't have to. It will be done. Ooh, there's some best water. And some squirrels. Zargal, you surrender or you die. You make choice. You make choice quickly. Zargal has no patience to wait for slow-witted city folk. What do you want? You have to be choking. Our money is very important. You very stupid. You die screaming. Zargal strongest. Zargal, Geltic, and Malkax. Well... God damn it. Uh-huh. I'll do it. I understand. You have need of me? Damn it, Rasad. I know you're tired, but like Please aid me. I am Greek, dude. Lune guides my hand.
We about level up me. That's cool. No! Oh shit, we're poisoned? Fix that poison, please. And I will heal this guy. If what do we have on these paper. bodies? Arrows. What? what? Are you, these guys just have the ability to poison their arrows? And that's a bandit. God diggity doobal. Oh, that guy had a magic sword. Not a problem. Get the bandits. Whoa, that's a lot of bandits. What is up with that? Just go kill people with your melee weapons. They're just bandits. And ghouls. Alright, that was interesting. Not a problem. Well, that's like... 300 gold right there. From all the bandit scalps. I know I don't Could need to done. pick up all these arrows, but it's just a habit from old. I look till you make well, my I'll life. do my best. It will be done. Old times. It will be done. My instincts say you're gonna run out of arrows because you were only able to carry so many. That's obviously not the case now. You can carry a lot of arrows now. Yeah, with ease. Is that two of the same scroll? Hmm. And oh. fine. It will be done. Let's level up. Thacko in reduced. Now I'm even better at hitting stuff. To hit armor class zero, I need to roll a 14 with my bow, or I need to roll a 12 with my sword. That's pretty good. So, after giving it some thought, I want oh. to ask you a favor. Okay, what do you need? Even though I first ran away because I was scared, I've begun to think I should find a way to reduce the unfortunate side effects of my otherwise awesome spells. Aren't unfortunate side effects the main feature of wild magic? It only seems that way because everyone forgets all the times my untamed magic made my spells more powerful. All anyone remembers is when I accidentally incinerated a classmate. Casting wild magic is like playing a flute by ear. I just kind of picked it up as I went along, doing what felt natural. In magical terms, I can play a pretty mean tune. But when I miss a note, the flute shoots fire at everyone. Also, the flute sometimes turns me into a hamster. Anyway, wild mages tend to keep to themselves for obvious reasons, but I've heard about one nearby. They say he's very old and wise. I guess any wild mage would have to become wise to survive long enough to become old. That's exactly what I was thinking. He must know a thing or two about living with wild magic. Where can we find His him? name is Adoy. And he was last spotted to the east of Firewine Bridge. Thanks. You're more than a convenient escape from vicious red wizards. You're a real pal. I stand okay. ready. Interesting. Definitely never done that before, given that she is a new character. I hope that Rasad has a quest to do. It will be done. 
And this is back where we fought the cleric. The crazy guy who was raising the dead and talking to them as if they were his family. Wolf. Uh, no. guides my hand. What do no. I am gone? Use your ranged weapons, guy. Your wish? I am pre I shall commit to the task. With ease. This map is so much more leisurely compared to the one that gave us like 8,000 experience. I really don't understand why there's that way to leave the Nashville Mines that leads to that map that is a death trap for someone that doesn't really know how to play the game when the Nashville Mines was like, you know, Cobalt's. All right, have we explored it all? Looks like we have. Well, I guess let's go to High Hedge to find Melicamp's master Valentier, I think is the guy's name. I don't want to carry around this chicken forever. A dread wolf. Okay, it can still take damage. Two dread wolves. Interesting. Yep. Why did it suddenly attack Jahira? Don't attack I him. Shall commit to the task. Attack someone wearing armor, please. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Interesting. I don't know why those were there. They're as hard as cave bears, though, according to the experience. All right, back up to High Hedge. I did I even explore High Hedge? Oh yeah, I went there and then down to get to not a problem. The place. All right, skeletons. C uh, can I help you? Bunch of skeletons on this map. There's no point in attacking them with ranged weapons. Because you'll do so little damage. Much better to just wade through slapping them. Even the mage. It will be done. Here we go. Oh, casting spells isn't as easy as I make it look. Uh -huh. I'm tired. It will be done. Hello, Thalantir. This place is interesting I looking. Be Thalantir, a mighty mage of Baragoth. I sincerely hope you have some reason for bothering me. I've already stated that I wish you to leave. <laughs> well, it's rather amusing. You see, I happen to rescue this, uh, talking chicken? Chickens do not talk, so quite obviously it is a polymorphed being of some kind. Spells such as that were off in time, or wear off in time, or can be dispelled. Tis a simple matter, and one not worth the waste of my day. I'm quite aware of the mute status of chickens. Thank you very much. This is a transformed man. It's also a man who claims to be your apprentice. That's why I brought him. Apprentice? I have had no apprentice. I teach no one about what I... Wait. Melacamp? Melacamp, is that you? 
Yes, Master Thalantir, it is I. I am no master to you, and you are no apprentice. What gall you have to expect help from me. I see you two are well acquainted. If he is not your student, but you do know of him. A student wishes to learn, while this fool wishes only to have knowledge. I will tutor no one who does not understand the ramifications of what I have to teach. Not getting the quick gratification, gratification he wished, he instead chose to steal from me. You speak of so much, but show so little. I only wish to earn a fraction of the power you possess. It has taken me some fifty odd years of life to gain the power I wield, and the will not to use it. You are but a baby in comparison. Frankly, I'm surprised you cha changed into such an old chicken. How did you manage that, by the by? You were muddling the simplest cantrip when last I observed you. I have progressed much since then, and I borrowed a few items to speed the process. As I thought. Well, it's obvious you can steal my tools, but not my understanding of them. Hold still while I dispel this foolish facade. Can't very well get my property back while it's polymorphed into- Wait a moment. I do not possess any items that allow the casting of that enchantment. Wait. Oh dear. Melacamp, listen very carefully. What did you take? Nothing too valuable, I swear. Just some components. A few scrolls, a beat up pair of bracers, a blank spell book, some parchment. A pair of- Oh no, you little fool. The bracer is in my locked and trapped safe. I certainly hope you can develop a taste for chicken feed because you are going to be stuck the way you are for a very long time. I know I stole from you, but you can't leave me like this. Please, Master Dalantir. Please. It's not a matter of whether I wish to help or not, simply that I do not have the power to undo what you have done. What sort of item could cause this? The magic that so many revere today was not always the same as it is now. Any adventurer worth his salt should know this, and know that not every bauble they wring from a dungeon will be helpful. The bracers in question were a vain little reminder of... Well, it doesn't really matter, does it? Suffice to say that I have no idea what their intended function was, and I was in no position to ask their former owner. Years have passed since my release, and the spoils of that netheril ruin remain as enigmatic as ever. They resist even the strongest divination, and attempts to dispel result only in explosive consequences. Some things should just stay buried. Is there nothing that can be done? If you are willing, then I will do what must be done. We will need a component that I do not have on hand, and it will be your job to get it. I will require the head of an undead creature. Any simple skeleton skull will do. Reincarnate? But does that spell not require... The recipient to be dead? There must be a dead element, yes. That is what the skull is for. I cannot fully explain what I am to try, but it's something of a reversal on the reincarnation scheme. The age of the enchantment that changed you may allow for a loophole in the laws of magic. Of course, it may just kill us both in the casting. Such is life. Off you go to some dungeon or another. Return with the skull. Okay. I'm gonna save. So I'm pretty sure there's a 50-50 shot of this working. And it's just... You don't get a choice. Done. Hello again, my young adventurers. I see you have the needed component. Well... Shall we see if our young man regains his life, or if he'll eventually be someone's feast hall dinner? Oh, he died. And that, as they say, is that. I fear our young friend did not survive the casting, and I feel a touch weary myself. Such are the ways of magic, unpredictable at the best of times. Do not feel responsible for his death. There was little more we could have done. His body simply couldn't withstand the change once again. A lesson, I suppose, for the rest of us. Take good care to treat found items with respect. If you'll excuse me, I have some work to do. I imagine you've a dungeon to storm somewhere. I wish you intelligence, because luck runs out. But his attempt to restore Melicamp was unfortunately a failure. Alright, I'm going to see if we can load and get the version where he doesn't die. With ease.
All right, we got it. I have arms. Arms and hands and feet. Oh, thank you, Master Thalantir. Thank you. Yes, yes, boy. Now be quiet a moment. Plastic, the bracers are no longer on him. It is as I feared. Likely they either spent what magic they had in a single charge, or it is their want to be whisked away after inflicting the damage they do. I had hoped to seal them away, but now it's certain they will fall into the hands of some other unfortunate fool. Tell me, Melicamp, do you quite feel yourself again? I... I think so. Good. Though it was the greatest of luck, you did not retain a wing for a limb. You always were a bit cockeyed, but I suppose that doesn't count. I suggest you remain here, so that I might keep an eye on you. If you insist on playing with the forces of magic, at least I should see that you understand them. Perhaps you will be a touch more cautious, now that you have experienced what can go wrong. Yes, Master Thalantir. I suppose, your master, I must be. And you, Sir Wombat, I trust you will be cautious in your travels as well? Uh, alright. Gorion would be proud of your So doing actions. it that way, I think, gave me more XP, so I'm glad I it reloaded. Be done. Okay. Will he buy... Nope, he doesn't buy them for any better. Okay. Sell that. Sell this. I'm never gonna use these. He buys jewelry, okay. He'll buy my two-handed sword for 25? Why? Weird. He sells a bunch of cool darts, a bunch of cool arrows. He has a ton of arrows plus one that I could buy. Bunch of potions. Scrolls, a potion case. Lots and lots of scrolls. The Claw of Kazgoroth. Little is known about this item, other than that the claw itself was taken from the corpse of the great beast Kazgoroth. It has multiple enchantments that all become activated when the claw is worn as a ring. The image of the wearer becomes blurred and more difficult to hit with weapons or target with spells. It has one drawback. It seems to fuel its power at the blood of its wearer. Because of this, the wearer of the claw will often be more sickly and more susceptible to poisons. So they get minus two con... But their armor class increases, especially versus missile attacks. Uh, they're really bad against saving versus death, which is versus poisons. But they gain better saves against everything else, and it's cursed. So they can't take it off. Or the Horn of Kazgaroth. This horn is thought to be made from one of the tusks of the great beast Kazgaroth, who imbued it with enchantments is unknown, but it is a very potent item. When blown, no sound issues. Instead, you are encased in a globe of power. The bubble gives the user magical resistance, as well as partially deflecting missile attacks. It only lasts three rounds, and it draws from the life force of the user every time it is used. Damage done to user unknown. But it gives you immunity to low-level spells, better armor class to stuff, and it's just a cool item. Robe of the good Archmagi, robe of the neutral Archmagi. Armor class 5, saving throws, magic resistance. If I had the money, I would buy this. But I don't. So I won't. Are there any cool second level spells I could buy? What is horror? Level 2. All enemies within the area of effect. Earthly luck. Mirror image. Strength. Where 
Ray of Enfeeblement. Spook. Power word sleep. Hmm. Ooh, flame arrow. Oh, that's level three though. Old person? Also level three. Detect invisibility, my own invisibility. This guy doesn't sell Melf's acid arrow. I would have liked Melk's Acid Arrow. Well, I think I'll buy some arrows from him. So that's 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. Good. All right. So I want each arrow user to have 20 of those. And his bullets plus one are cheaper than the ones back in Baragos 2. Okay. Cool. So now, who did I buy those for? Okay. Distribute these out. So many arrows. I'm going to give those all to Khalid because he doesn't need all of his inventory space. He doesn't pick stuff up like I do. And I could sell all of these to him. I guess he could enchant them. Is that why he buys them? All right, there we go. That pretty much paid for the arrows. Not for the bullets, but for the arrows. Okay. It will be done. I'm not going to explore in his house because it's his house. Could I rest here, though? Can I rest in this house? Can I rest in this house? Okay. With ease. I cannot rest in this house. Can I rest on his doorstep? Nature servant awaits. After casting my healing spells? All right, I can rest on his doorstep. Okay. Let's identify some stuff. Ring of Princes plus one. It's just a ring of protection, but this ring and several of its type were originally crafted to protect the sons of King Castor Dewis. Though who uttered the enchantment is unknown. Uh, oh, I think... Is that what this one's also called? Oh, it is. Huh. Okay. Well, now she can wear one. Which is good. Let's identify the Whistling Sword plus two. Amidst the plains of the Eastern Shar, which is like the African plains of Faerun, according to lore, there lived a small human blacksmith. 
whose nearly dwarven height did not do his soul justice. Though a skilled weaponsmith, his true gift was his ability to whistle a heartfelt song that could cause a grown man to cry like a newborn. Only a reclusive mage shared and enjoyed time with this diminutive man, as others could only see his small size as a source of amusement. Deaf to the smith's song because of their own prejudices, their ridicule slowly grew into cruel torment, which eventually persuaded the light-hearted man to leave his home forever. Before he left, he forged this weapon as a gift for his one friend, who also enchanted it during the making. Thus the blade sweetly whistles to its wielder when unsheathed. It was not long after that that the mage also deserted the town in disgust, taking the sword with him on his journeys. And it's just a plus two short sword. Nice. Hell yeah. Her Thacko, as a thief, is still 17. That's really good. Can I identify this one? No. But I can learn this spell. Hmm? Oh, shit. I should sell... All of the spell scrolls to this Stand guy. Stand back and watch this. I'll do it. Can I see his... I'm pretty sure he has, like, flesh giant... Yeah, flesh golems protecting his... His home. Where's his bed? I think if you go in and... Like, if you enter here and then you don't talk to him, the flesh golems are hostile. Which is scary. Hey, Millicamp. Um, oh, I should take them out of the spell case first. Not that one, not that one. This one, this one, this one. This one. This one, this one. Sell all of these. Heck yeah. Even more money. Stand now that paid for all the bullets. And watch this. All right. Not a problem. Let us travel around. We'll probably find more Hello, skeletons pal. we have to kill. Oh, hi. Whoa, slow down. I'm trying to plan the grandest of heists here. With all your trumpet about, I can't hear a word I'm thinking. You have to say it out loud first. Okay, okay, here's the plan. There's a big-time mage living just over that rise. You... Well, right next to his house. Magic items scattered all over the place. He's got these two hideous flesh monsters. And no shadows. Okay. It seems I have accidentally altered the course of history by stumbling upon the thief Permidian Stark. He was planning the greatest heist of all time. But he left. Okay. That was odd. Skeletons, huh? Melee. 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 Yes? Melee. With ease. Melee. For the group. Uh -huh. Melee. Let's Not go. Not a problem. They're just skeletons. I'm not picking up their stuff. And screw it, we'll all just carry our melee weapons. <laughs> oh wow, I didn't realize that uh, his home was that close to the east side of the map. Ooh, gnolls. Okay, ranged weapons. Your wish? Yes, oh, oh, what is it this time? Authority figure? Wait, 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 wait. No, don't use those ones. Use those ones. If none are better, I stand ready. Knolls are a no lot problem. bigger. Potion of insight. Purdue short sword. I think there's a dude named Purdue that I'm supposed to give that to. A null veteran, huh? Hmm? It will be done. Not a problem. Uh, 
how to clear the map. Alright, let's clear in this direction now. This is one of the most annoying maps to clear because skeletons just keep spawning, but what are you going to do? I guess theoretically I could just have Rasad run around. I shall commit to the task. I'll do my best. Yes. Damn it, Shahira. Shahira. Damn a win. Khalid leveled up. Jahira! What is happening? Come on, you have good armor classes. How are these skeletons hitting you with darts? Ammo in. I feel so cold. Yeah, okay. I stand ready. We'll put the blood back in your body with magic. You idiot. This is one of the reasons this map is annoying. Level up, Khalid. He's just better at hitting stuff. What level is he? Four? And I am also level four? Cool. Are we good? Will be done. Okay. Goddamn skeletons. I try and go west from here? See what's over in that direction? Yeah. The area south done. of Candlekeep. More knolls. I am prepared. Ranged weapons. Is there a hotkey? F2. F2. F3. F2. With ease. Beat him up, Rasad. Oh, yeah. Kick. Kick punch. Kick puncher. I shall commit to the task. Not a problem. This is such a big map. This part of Baldur's Gate is good for streams. Instead of the endless jump cuts. Oh, a house. With a bunch of spiders. Okay. bunch of spiders doing outside it this house. Done. Anything special about this house? Hello? Guys, go in. Go in. Guys. Go in. I shall commit to the Anyone task. in here? Is it abandoned? Hello? Looks abandoned. Quick save. Block. I've done had enough of this. I'll wait, Khalid. But try. This way. 
lockpick failed. God dang it, doobles. Not a problem. Break it open. I failed to force the lock. Uh, I want to know what's in here. With ease. What if it's a magic item? Not a problem. I don't want to come back to this later. Are you kidding me? Ugh. Wolf. Ooh, lots of wolves. Skeletons. Uh, go punch. Go stab. Go staff. For the group. Go stab. Mage, what are you doing? I'll do it. the mage not a problem mages have way too low of health in this game i guess that's why people often make fighter mages so that they have more hit points and can wear armor when they're not casting spells Have we finished exploring High Hedge? We've done it. All right. Well, now that that's done and Melicamp the Chicken has helped, where do I want to go? Do I want to go to the carnival? Do I want to try and find Captain Brague? Do I want to go here? I feel like going there is probably dangerous. It's pretty far away from civilization. I know the coast has like sirens and stuff, and that's not smart to go to. And in order to get to Adoy's Enclave for Nira, I have to go past the Firewine Bridge. I don't even know how dangerous that place is. I don't know if I've ever even been. Or maybe I went once years and years ago. I will decide this next time I play. For now, this is a good space to end the stream. We finished the Nashville Mines and leveled up a lot. Cleared up some side quests. Seems good to me. Thank you, YouTube, for watching. Thank you, my friends who showed up. I always appreciate having people to talk to so I'm not screaming into the void. See you next time.